welcome Bravidius to Brawlhalla. I'm back. Hello, welcomers. I'm here again with my lovely wife. Hello, lovely wife. Hello. And we're going to wreck some face. Would you like to do co-op or competitive to um, start? Sometimes I'm a little too competitive, so maybe co-op would be best for our relationship. Agreed. Let's do teams <laughs> and wreck some computers. Sounds good. Team damage is off. Awesome, yeah. Um, I think this is the one I want. Cool, sounds great. You can customize a little bit. I believe that most of the customization options are tied to store purchases. It's free to play and it functions a lot like Castle. Super Smash Brothers and it's quite fun. Perhaps a bit more simplistic than Smash Brothers, but very fun. Yeah, there's no like combos Castle. or whatever. Like anyway, Castle. so I think that will be it. Yeah? Yep, let's do random. Sure. Cool. Fighting a samurai and a Amazon? Or do you think I that's an Amazonian? Two, one, and we are the red team, correct? Indeed. Whoa! <laughs> I almost fell off right away. So, you can grab these horns and then use X no. to fire off that fire stream that went across the screen. You can pick up weapons or jump off and accidentally fall to your almost demise. And you have two weapons based on what character you're playing as. So in this two case, weapon I have options. weapon options, yeah. And it randomly generates one of them when you pick up a weapon. So you may get the weapon you prefer, and you may not. Yep. I think it actually. But you can always drop it and try for another one. Yep, I think it actually alternates between the two weapons. Get back up there. So if you picked up a sword last, I think you'll get a claw next um, time. I think not, because I have gotten the same thing in a row. Okay, we'll conduct research on the subject. It's very fun, very high pace. See, I just got my not gun weapon two times in a row. I see. No! That was good. One thing, if you have a weapon, you can't pick up any of the items on the ground, but you can throw your weapon with the right bumper, like so, and then pick up something else if you like. And yes, I did get claws twice in a row there too, to exhibit that element. All right? Smash attacks are just B with a direction and you will do a strong hit of whatever type your weapon dictates. I think I prefer the claws on this guy, but I do like the katana idea. Just, I'm not having as much success with it. It doesn't sound like a good idea, but there's not as much of a range to them, so... It is kind of ironic that the guns seem to have less range than the actual melee weapons. I mean, I'm sure that there's... It's a balancing thing, I'm sure. There's also, like, aiming and all of that stuff that's going on, but maybe it's hard to... Oh, no! Aiming always helps. I'm very big on smash attacks. I, I know about building up damage with your quick attacks, but I find I'm most successful if I am able to connect with smash attacks. They're a bit slower. They're probably ah, not I officially called so. smash attacks in this, since that's kind of a Smash Bros thing, but it's pretty I, universally understood. I apparently don't know how to use this weapon. So the hammer, one, one trick that you can work really well with the hammer, if they're above you, you can jump and then hit up B, and it will try to throw them down, like chuck them at the ground. Yeah, but sometimes instead of actually using the weapon, it has me kicking, and I'm like, I don't want to kick, I want to hit them with the hammer. I want to pick up this bomb. Yeah, I 
it's it's a very precise game in the sense that you really have to plan and know where they're going to be. It's, it's very hard. Or well, in my case, you can just, you know, be a, a button masher. And button mashing is a tried out. and true <laughs> functional strategy Five, in a lot of four, games. Three, two, so I like this game. In one way, it is nice that it's... Red team wins. So we ran out of time, and yay, we got the most. I like that it is a bit more simple, but... Um, It was kind of nice to have those combo options in Smash Brothers. Definitely. Having combos and also a um, wider variety of special moves. Yeah, different kinds of attacks you can use. I don't think that there's anything wrong with the way that this game is designed. I just prefer that particular element of Smash Although, Brothers Brawl. being able to just get in and play a game with somebody without having to like worry about them knowing the moves and yeah, such. Catching yeah, catching up to the learning curve. It's probably a bit more accessible in that regard, no. although Smash Brothers is quite accessible as well. Now we're going to be playing a variant called Brawl Ball, and this is a football-esque game. I'm trying it's to watch it. It's almost more like Capture the Flag than... How do you story. confirm your... Okay. Oh, I'm sorry. No problem. I did not realize that I was not... That's okay. I, I did not know it was bad for me. <laughs> We're both going to be cats. We're going to be cats, Like yeah. cats and cat wannabes. <laughs> yeah. I ain't lying. That's, that's for sure, yeah. Uh, just, uh... Oh. So, this pillar, this blue pillar that I'm at, can be crossed by the blue team, but not the red team. So it's just a last defensive structure. And you want to get the ball into that little zone at the right or left, depending on which direction you're going. You want to grab that um, weapon? This weapon down? Sure, and then I'll defend you. You okay. cannot pick up the ball, just like other items, if you have a weapon in the hand. So if you're going to play this way with a weapon, it's good oh, to have one person run the ball, <laughs> preferably to the enemy's goal. And then... The other person tries to feel that. I was like, why am I not getting any oh. resistance? Well, that's why. I don't think the enemy AI I just really. Pay attention, sorry. It's all good. I don't think the enemy AI really understands the idea behind this game. Oh, I, totally I mean, they they understand that they need to get the ball to the end zone, but I don't think they really play the game particularly well. Now I threw the ball off the stage. Which reset its position. No. Very no. Oh, that was awesome! So she threw the ball to try to get it back on the stage, and then I caught it in midair. No, 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 no! Oh! <laughs> Noise! So you can't just walk through that area. You actually have to stand there for like a second. Yeah, there's a there's a <laughs> scanner that. Make sure that you're actually in the end zone for a period of time. I guess they do kind of understand passing. We're just playing with medium bots. We should probably go online and try that experience out too. But I just want to show off, in this episode, I just want to show off the different game modes. If this is something you'd like to see us play online or with some friends, let us know and we'll we'll both acquire friends and no I'm just kidding <laughs> and we'll make that happen no they got a point ah, <laughs> trying to get that's down. okay I can ju make the jumps necessary to get over there it's all good we're enjoying playing games together and uh, it's a good way that we can set aside some time to be with one another and recreate so this is really cool How many glad we get to share this with you guys I believe five is winning. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Five is winning. Five total. <laughs> I like how the opponents, when they lose on their on the second place stands, are giving the slow clap. They're like the slow clap. <laughs> slow Good clap. game. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> nice. All right. So I believe there's a rotation of heroes, kind of like in League of Legends and such, Random. where there's different ones available. Um, to play for free at any given time, and I appreciate that. And you can kind of see which characters you like, and see whether they, there are things that you want to either pick up or just save in-game currency for. 
you don't need to spend any money on this game. You can just play it and Random. have a good time with it. And I like that they do that. I appreciate any game that allows you to unlock all of the functional things without spending money so you can spend your time or your money on a thing. And I don't believe any of the elements of the game suffer because you don't have them unlocked. You may just not be able to play a certain character, but it's not as if that character is fundamentally stronger than some other character. Now this is this is Bomb Skidball, which is a fantastic sport name. Um, what, what is the goal here? I believe the goal is to have a bomb strike the target oh. on the enemy's side. Chucking them at the enemy's face is always nice as well. Almost. So there's kind of a sweet spot. I don't I don't know where it is, but theoretically there is one. <laughs> to aim and shoot and hit the enemy's goal. Meanwhile, you can beat each other up. I don't know if that any of these game modes adds too terribly much, but imagine if you're using it as like a couch co-op <laughs> game, you can get a lot out of it by just switching modes and seeing how well you do there. It's, like it's definitely a party game, and it is on PC, which is one thing that differentiates it from Smash Brothers. So you can't throw it directly up from underneath it, or at least I haven't found a way to do so. I'm really <laughs> I can't not doing terribly well. <laughs> yeah, yeah this one that's is okay. Harder than it, looks. Oh, and I wasn't it is. Five, four, three, two, Ooh, almost. And and while you're as young as you used to be, I am not. Blue team wins. So. Everyone got first place. Good job, it was everyone. Like field day. Everybody gets. Yeah, everybody gets a award. participation award. Snow Brawl, I have not seen this mode, so we must obviously play it. Random. I shall be Shadow Man. Kinda looks like Mega Man, the shadow character. Okay. Queen Kai. Okay. I have no idea what this is all about. Neither do I. It may involve snowballs. Would you vote for a map? Or random? Cool. Whatever. It's all good. I forget that you get to vote for it, and that it's not just one yeah. person choosing. It's democracy. Man. <laughs> Three, two, one, okay. roll. So you have an unending, you have like an unending un snowball supply. Unlimited amount of snowballs because there's snow all over the ground. Apparently. And you can probably only do damage with snowballs, which is fantastic. This is. Quite pleasant. You just stand and wait for them to come to you. It's pretty easy. <laughs> yeah, I imagine that's different when you're playing with live humans. Ah! Except for I wasn't paying attention to them behind me. Oh, juggled! Three hits! Yay. I like juggling. Oh, well, you can kind fun. of charge it up, it looks like. Dominate. Yeah, if you hold down the, okay, the button. Okay, so that's cool. I probably should have published that fact. Thanks. <laughs> Good rest. I kind of feel like the big kids in a snow fight picking up yeah, one ones. Yeah, we're just like... <laughs> we're just... We already have everything. Oh, well, we're we're doing we are doing great, whole, and then we... We have our whole over. supply and a little fort made. Exactly. And we're just waiting for the little kids to come around the corner. They're trying to get their first snowball rolled up. <laughs> I'm like, look, Mom, let me make a snow angel. Pow! <laughs> <Yep>. <laughs> They don't even know they're playing nice, the same but... game that we are. <laughs> yeah. It's no problem. Whoop, 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 whoop. Got a 
little overconfident and pay attention again. This mode is super fun. This is really fun, actually. It like, didn't sound fun at all, really, at first, but... Not having to worry about what weapon you're getting or... Any of that jazz, it's really cool. Yep. You do kind of have to time it. A little bit. Definitely. Awesome game mode. This one gets props. Ow, right at the back of her head. <laughs> All of the maps it's that awesome. I, it is, yeah. All of the maps that I've seen for this seem to be on a pretty small scale, True. Um, which I guess is a feature in that it keeps you close to the other combatants and makes the combat a little more. It interesting. It definitely changes the strategy for it. Yeah, it's no Hyrule Temple, and you're on the other side of the universe from everybody else. Especially when you're trying to play with a team member and you can't see if they're on the other side or not. Yeah. It is good to be able to take in the whole situation in one glance. Three, two, one. We win? I suspect we won. Slow clap. Wow. 69, 35, 16, and 8. All right. Your KOs are always like three times more than mine. I have always. no formal opinion on that subject. Strikeout. Let's check, let's check this out. Okay. Is this another team one? I think so. Queen it may just be. It just because it be. changed the color on mine. Yeah, this is probably free for all. Okay. It says teams off, so I just was wondering. So I was just wondering before I confirmed it. Yeah. What's going on? I don't know. I pressed A. A on that controller has been giving us grief. Oh, you know what? It's not that. It's that this I was trying to do like a Queen player thing. Oh. Oh, is it a whole team that I'm getting for myself? I guess. Um, oh, yeah, you're, so you're picking three characters? Oh, no. it's like a tag team match. Okay, that makes sense. Awesome. I, I don't know. I guess. Cassidy. I get it. I think. There have, in some fighting games, there'll be like elimination where you pick a team of heroes. Yeah, but it's just guess. funny because I'm playing as. Three, two, it's on me. one. Right, yeah. Yeah, that is that is unusual. In in like a fighting game where Usually it's all like the you just have so many lines, which is what we're looking for. When that mode is used in fighting games, it's usually because each of the heroes has a different set of advantage and disadvantages, and you just tag them out. Sure enough, yeah, I'm onto my second character, Lord Brax, at the moment. Yay. Ah! Stay on the platform. Stay on the platform. Now, here's the thing. I'm not going to be able to, like, not hit you. That's okay. We're not really cooperating. Ah! Ah! Was, oh, was oh Frax. Yes. I like lances. Lances are quite good. Hammers can be good, um, but they, I think their skill ceiling, as it were, no! is a little bit higher. No! <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to get so many points, you're going to have to call me Frax a million. Oh I went there. I did it. Dude. That was awesome. Indeed. I, I'm sure I can't replicate it, but... <laughs> That's okay. That was awesome. Unintentional awesomeness is often the best. You'll excuse us if we're being unusually civil to one another. Um, you may not be accustomed to that watching YouTubers online, <laughs> but it, it is uh, something no. that I try to do <laughs> on my channel. So. I threw my weapon to try to get a new one, and then it threw me off. I was thrown off. Oh, now you're out? Or are no, you... no, I just... 
Are there ledge grabs in this? Oh, so there's just the like glued on the wall thing. The wall no! slides. <laughs> Boom! Oh, that did not do what I thought it was going to. No! No, no, no! Oh! 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 oh. <laughs> Preemptive haws oh are not always a good thing. Alright. Victory. Slow. Slow clap. 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 Yeah. Yeah. I don't know if I like that one. That might be fun if you if you had more than just two people playing. Agreed. Can we use teams on, on this? Dodge bomb sounds super fun. Uh, yeah. Uh <laughs> <laughs> guys? <laughs> So one thing that would be nice is if, in customization, if you didn't have any other options, if they didn't present them to you. That's just a thought on my, my part. Where? Wow. Okay. This is a different, different game than I thought it was going to be. And that's fine, I guess. No! It drops you at random platforms. Yeah, it so, appears to, so there might be someone there already. Right. And falling is quite bad. Interesting. Yep, I already don't like this one. <laughs> yeah, there's not much map to speak of. I kind of get the idea behind it. I take it the bombs are the things that... Yeah, I mean, you're supposed to be throwing them like dodgeballs, but... Whoa! I just bombed myself. I don't know that it brings much to the table that this snow brawl doesn't. There's and probably a little more. The fact that there's only these small little platforms, really... Yeah, it doesn't give you a lot of strategic options. I just bombed myself again. <laughs> I mean, maybe we're supposed to just stand on the platforms or something. That's what I was trying to do, but it... I mean, even that, you can't do anything. I'm trying to not throw them at myself, but it's apparently not working. That's okay. It'll be entertaining. I'm done, apparently. Oh, you're out? Yep. Oh, good. You got so the guy. So is he. Nope. He made oh. it back up there. Yes. Red Eight team three. wins. Hey, so that is Brawl Hall. That was a... On that one. On that one. Yeah, I'm going <laughs> to vote that particular game mode down. But I do want to thank you all for watching, and I hope you have a lovely day.